Published in the journal Nature Machine Intelligence, scientists explored how artificial intelligence technologies for drug discovery could be misused for the de novo design of biochemical weapons. A thought experiment evolved into a computational proof. An artificial intelligence model created 40,000 chemical weapons compounds in just six hours after being given the task by researchers. A team of scientists was using AI to look for compounds that could be used to cure disease, and part of this involves filtering out any that could kill a human. As part of the potentially harmful implications of new technology, scientists flipped a switch in its AI algorithm and had it find the most lethal compounds. The team wanted to see how quickly and easily an artificial intelligence algorithm could be abused if set on a negative rather than a positive task. Once in bad mode, the AI invented thousands of new chemical combinations, many of which resemble the most dangerous nerve agents in use today. Among the compounds invented by the AI were some similar to VX, extremely toxic nerve agents that can cause twitching in even tiny doses. The researchers said one of the scariest aspects of their discovery was how easy it was to take a widely available data set of toxic chemicals and use AI to design chemical weapons similar to the most dangerous currently. Creating a compound as powerful as VX shocked the researchers, as even a tiny drop of this chemical can cause a human to twitch. A large enough dose can lead to convulsions and stop a person from breathing, and the new compound created by the AI could have a similar effect, the team predicts. Researchers said they have a lot of data sets of molecules that have been tested to see if they are toxic or not. In particular, the one that the researchers focus on here is VX. It is an inhibitor of what's known as acetylcholinesterase. VX is lethal because it actually stops your diaphragm, your lung muscles, from being able to move, so your lungs become paralyzed. The idea for flipping the switch on the AI to turn it bad came from the Convergence Conference, organized by the Swiss Federal Institute for Nuclear, Biological, and chemical protection. The goal is to explore the implication that new tools and developments could have in the realm of chemical and biological weapons, even unintentionally. The machine learning specialist works to implement models in drug discovery, and a large fraction of them focuses on how toxic a compound might be. They use large datasets of what is toxic, how it is poisonous, and its impact. They do this to determine whether potential new drugs will prove too dangerous for humans. For the new study, they flipped it around, using the AI model they created to look for the most toxic, most dangerous molecules and see if they can make it worse. They found it could generate these molecules through any space of chemistry, and not just random, but ones that can be directed by the team. Most of the toxic molecules resembled chemicals used in warfare, including Versus, and this was done despite the model has never seen these chemicals before, or any chemical warfare agent. When AI does good things, it could do better than humans. But once AI is in bad mode, it could do more evil things. This is what people really need to think about.